Hi, this is Natalie Ryder, and you're watching SBRPicks.com. Manchester City host West Brom on Saturday. Now, this is a must win for the home team as they're falling slightly behind the title race and they'll be looking to rebound from their Champions League loss uh, during the week. So let's hear what their guest Lee Phelps has to say about the match and see what top tip he's got for us today. Now, City is the obvious choice here, but they are on bad form right now. Uh, they'll be tired from their trip to Barcelona. Uh, what do you expect you to see on the pitch? I'm expecting to see a better Manchester City. You know, when they've gone out of the Champions League in previous seasons, they have bounced back, and it's almost like they, they've got the ability to put that behind them and get on with the task in hand. The task in hand is putting pressure on Chelsea and keeping Arsenal, Manchester United and Liverpool at bay um, in that, so they can keep that second spot at the very least. Um, I expect a better Manchester City here. And I know they were poor at Burnley, but, you know, they, they were away from home. You know, I think at home, it's a different kettle of fish, this. You know, this is Manchester City at the Etihad. Yeah. West Brom, don't go away and try and win games under Tony Pulis. It's as simple as that. That's not what he does. And mm -hmm. there's no way they're going to go away and try and beat Manchester City. I think if they did try that, interestingly, I think we, we could have a very different result. Because in Sado Berahino and Brown Day, they've got goal scorers. They've got some very forward-thinking players. But he doesn't do that, Tony Pulis. So there's no point in thinking the game being that way. I think they'll really shut up shop West Brom, very strong defensively, very strong in midfield, and I think they'll try and contain Manchester City. I think they will get away with it for a while. I mean, I don't quite think they'll make it to half-time because they've got a bit of a habit of conceding first-half goals, West Brom. But anyone who fancies the half-time draw, full-time City might be, uh, might be worth a look. I think they might, might score before half-time, though. Man City. So, uh, but yeah, I think it'll be that kind of game where West Brom try and just park the bus, as Jose Mourinho would say. Yeah. Well, that kind of sounds like uh, to me a sort of uh, uh, City winning to nil here. Can West Brom score at Etihad Stadium? Can. Obviously, they can score, but um, I don't think they will. I think there'll be a lot of determination from this Manchester City team after what's happened over the last couple of weeks. You know, it's, there's been rumours of arguments within the camp. I think it's time that they actually, you know, started to knuckle down. Joe Hart was phenomenal against Barcelona in midweek. And if, he's, if that kind of performance has inspired his defenders, I think they can keep a clean sheet here. You know, they, they need to. They need to keep a clean sheet. They need to win the game. And they need to start chasing Chelsea down as best they can. Um, I agree with you, by the way. I think, I think the will to win to nil is the way to go. And it may be, maybe people would argue that you're putting too much trust in this city defence. But I think it's about time they stood up now. Yeah, uh, well, clean sheet there, uh, 2.15, uh, looking at the three-way line. Manchester City price, 1.33. Uh, the draw, 5.5. And West Brom, 10.5 uh, there. Uh, so very low, uh, very low odds for the City win. You can use that win as an accumulator bet. Uh, but what's your prediction for the match, Lee? Yeah, I mean, I, I, like, I like City to win to nail. I think that's a, it's a fair yeah. bet. You know, I think they'll get the job done. Um, I also like City to win under 2.5 goals. I think it could be that kind of game where it's, it's tight, but City eventually break them down. Uh, but I'll stick with the City to win to nil at uh, 2.15. Yeah, that's my bet as well, Lee. Lee, thanks for joining us. Pleasure.